I was introduced to Jim Sanders by Dick French all those years ago and uh, Jim farms uh, up on Exmoor and this is a very high part of the moor in fact. Um, I was introduced to him as a singer. I remember old ones singing in the barns and that, especially Jerry and I. They all each got their own song and after they finish here and, and they usually get proper merry and dance. I just remember that. I wasn't very big then. Because when I was young, I was so shy, I, nobody would get me to sing. Because when uh, I went to school, they'd have a concert and they'd let me to come in, and I'd never, I'd never go in the concert. They couldn't get me in it, no way. And I didn't start war after I got married. The sheep there all shorn and the wool carried home. It's in help to our master and flock. For the flesh it is good, it's the best of all food. And the wool it will clothe us up warm. And the wool it will clothe us up warm. That's the only bit I know about and I should let him know what the rest of what. When I met this tradition, it was in a fairly healthy state. It's absolutely impossible to predict what would have happened if I hadn't been here or if people of a similar interest hadn't been here. I suspect it would have continued in some shape or form. I don't regard myself as that important. I wonder what the sure thing is going to come to when that's finished, Jim. What are your idea about it? Well, no, I shall finish it quick, sure, I hope. <laughs> <laughs> well, I hope not. It's going to be sad with one of us, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Oh, I don't know. I think I'll give it another ten years. I think that'll be the end of it. I think so. The youngsters isn't interested in it, is so. I think it's going to change around again. Like you said, about ten years' time, and the youngsters will be changing over to someone else. That's what I remember. Well, you think they'll come round our way, I think, do you? Well, uh, they'll come with some different one of them and what they're up to now, I well, think. I hope, I hope so. <laughs> What shall I try? Shall I paint pictures? No. Shall I sing songs? No. This was her wise reply. I think a lot of people, when they think about these country traditions, have an idea that they're going to be old and rustic and exactly as they have been for hundreds and hundreds of years. But what actually happens is that the song traditions accumulate songs as they go along, so it never surprises me to hear a, a very old song and then the next minute hear something that was possibly in the hit parade ten years ago. 20 years ago or whatever and it's this accumulation process is very much like what you can see around you in the physical environment we actually have got a very old part of the farmyard here so the whole aspect of the thing is shaped by what has been here for many many years but if you look around carefully you've got a plastic bag here and some breeze blocks and you've got the sheets are corrugated so the whole thing is exactly parallels i think the the way the song tradition operates. They say I will find it, I know sure enough, when fortune will come to my call. Ah, oh, the grass it is green around Valley James Town, and the blue sky is over it all. Kathleen is Jim Sanders' daughter. 
She helps to organize the sing songs, and Jim White is her husband. Come over the sea, oh, come over the sea, to Bali, James Dow. Oh, come over the sea, My dad, he used to drive those steam roller out here uh, many, many years ago, like, and he used to pedal his bike out here on a Monday morning and uh, live in the roller van. He used to tow this wooden van with iron wheels on behind the old steamer and used to park him up the top of the hill there and uh, do his day's work. And in the night, he'd go back to the old van and uh, the kids used to go up there and have a bit of a sing and used to have a wind-up gramophone. This is what I've been told by the locals, like, you know, of course, I can't remember that because for my time. And uh, he used to play these uh, records, see all the kids used to sit on the step outside and that was their entertainment at night times like. And of course when he got in the pub, my dad would pint or two and uh, he used to love singing. And that's where I got it from, you know. And well it sort of died away for, well, a few years. And then I met up with Sam and um, and then it all sort of come again like, you know, and we set forth and uh, got a few people interested in it. But I um, hope we can keep it going for a few more years anyway. It was that tune that we found from Wild Shepherd's Watch, wasn't it? Oh, that's right. Wild well, Shepherd watch their flocks by night, all seated on the ground, all seated on the ground. The angel Shone and glory shone around. 